All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem Rakakwadash. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is Shir Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work and truth and, and sincerity. Okay. Title of this video is The Name of the Lord is excellent okay the name of the Lord is excellent and his name is Yahweh okay the one that created everything which is name Yahweh okay it means he is or he exists okay now let me get this scripture I'm gonna just go down uh, break down Psalms the eighth um, um, chapter okay it says O oh Lord our Lord okay notice how the word Lord right here is in all caps and the word Lord right here is not in all caps okay now when you go into the word Lord okay it's two different Hebrew words okay one of them is the name of the Most High and the other one is not the name okay now it says um, O Lord okay O Lord which right here is all caps which that is in the Hebrew is Yah, Yah Ha wa okay which that means the existing one okay the one with the world inwardly calls Jehovah or and it also says the proper name of the one true God okay which is Yahweh okay he is or he exists Yah he Hawa is exist okay so it, it says he is he exists okay and then you have this one which is um out of one okay for for our lord O lord is yahweh our lord and lower caps is out of one okay and that means firm strong lord master okay lord master reference to men so this term lord can be referenced to men okay it's two different um two different uh hebrew words okay all right so going into the scripture it says oh yahweh our lord how excellent is your name in all the earth who has set your glory above the heavens out of the mouth of babes and sucklings has thou ordained strength because of your enemies. Okay? And when you look at um, the ones who are really giving the praises unto the Lord, okay? Those are the people who was living... A life that was contrary to giving praises to the Lord okay so when the Lord wakes you up and um, brings you into this truth and you realize how spiritual everything is you really appreciate the Lord um, more okay because the Lord has enemies okay who set out to basically destroy the truth okay and to make it make it seem like um the lord doesn't exist or giving that credit onto someone else it says that thou mightest steal the enemy and the avenger okay now the word still is uh sabat Okay, it says to cease, decease, 
dis desist, rest, okay, to exterminate, destroy, to cause to desist from, to remove, to cause to fail, okay, so basically, the Lord is going to put, or, or he's going to put to, 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 to death, or cease to, the people that are trying to say that he doesn't exist, okay, because you have a lot of people in the world that are saying that the Lord doesn't exist, okay? Atheists and um, people who say that the, the world came from, um, you know, basically uh, Big Bang Theory, okay? Or um, the Christians and stuff like that, okay, that say that the, so the Lord is a so-called white man. Okay, that's who the people, who the Lord is going to um, cause to cease to exist. The lies that are, that, are, that are set up against them. Okay, and he's throwing that through the mouth of his prophets. Okay, so it says, when I consider your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars which thou hast ordained, what is a what is man that thou art mindful of him, and the son of man that thou visit visitest him? Okay, when you look at everything in the in the in the, the heavens, okay. When you look at like the the like the, the the stars, like it says the moon. Okay, you gotta know that somebody created that man. Okay, the, 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 the order of how everything is in the world, something created that. It didn't just happen out of nowhere. But you have people out here that are living like somebody didn't create that. Okay, and then it says, what is man that thou art mindful of him? So the Lord made all these things. Okay, but yet he chose you to wake up and hear this truth. So that's one of the that's one of the reasons why it is the Lord's name is excellent. Okay, because the Lord the Lord visited us. Okay, Psalms one forty four and three. Lord, which that's Yahweh, what is man that thou takest knowledge of him or the son of man that thou makest account of him? Because guess what? The Lord has men out here that are written in that, that book that are slated for slavery. I mean, uh, for, for salvation. Okay, so lucky about that. But they, they, they're slated they're, they're in that, that, that book of life, okay, to receive the blessings, okay, and it's like, wh who are these, these men, okay, why, why, why are these men so special, you made all these things in this world, but you, yet you know these people that you, you made, and that's a beautiful thing, okay, It's Job 7 and 17. What is man that thou shouldest magnify him and that thou shouldest set your heart upon him? Because the Lord cares for you, you know, to, to, to even hear this truth. So it's like you got to give those those praises unto the Lord. Okay? And, and, and to see that he doesn't care for, for anybody else out here, these other nations, he cares for you. And only you can see that. Okay? So, um... And he gave us his son also, Yahweh to, to 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 redeem us. It says, For thou hast made him a little lower than the angels, and hast crowned him with glory and honor. Okay? Because, hey, the, the angels, when you look at what, what angels are... Are able to do okay 
like when they destroyed the, the, the city of uh, Sodom and Gomorrah, okay, that's just an example, okay, the angels, you know, they're, they're able to, uh, you can't see them, every man has, a, um, if you're a man of the Lord, you have angels around you that are protecting you, okay, and sometimes you don't even know whether or not that's an angel that you may be, may be uh, talking to. Because an angel, as the scriptures say, let me get that. It's in the book of uh, Hebrews. He Hebrews 13 and 2. Be not forgetful to en entertain strangers, for thereby some have entertained angels unawares. Okay, so an angel, you might be talking to an angel, you know, and guess what? The Lord probably sent that angel down to, to give you some, some type of honor or glory because the Lord loves you, okay? It says, thou madest him to have dominion over the works of your hands that thou, I mean, thou has put all things under his feet. And this, this, we're supposed to, to, to have a uh, dominion over the, the things that the Lord made, okay? But we don't have it. The, the so-called white man does, and he's basically not giving credit onto the Most High, okay? And saying that he exists, okay? That's why the so-called white man is making these GMO products and stuff like that. But we're supposed to have dominion over the earth. And guess what? The Lord created this. You know? This is this is the Lord, the scripture says that the Lord made all things for himself. Okay? Proverbs 16 and 4. The Lord has made all things for himself. Yeah, even the wicked for the day of evil. Okay? So that wicked is that 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 evil, them enemies that the Lord is going to going to put caused it to, to um, cease to exist okay it says all sheep and oxen yeah and the beast of the field all these these different animals okay and and you can do a lot with these different animals okay it says the fowl of the air and the fowl fish of the sea and whatsoever passes through the paths of the seas okay and when you look at all these things the Lord made them. Okay? He made these things. For a reason. It's for him. But he also made it for us to have dominion over. And it's like, who, who are we to, to be able to come into this truth? And to have this, 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 these blessings that the Lord, you know, is, is, has bestowed on us to, to get this truth. Okay? And that he's going to give one to us for keeping this truth. Okay? It says, O Lord, or O Yahweh, our Lord Yahweh, okay, our power, how excellent is your name in all the earth. So in everything, we're supposed to be able to look at everything and see the Lord. Okay? You see you see the so-called white man doing what he do? Well, you know that the Lord made them for him. You see, you, and, and an example of that is just, you know, how much of a devil they are, Esau, okay? You just see how much of a devil they are. You ain't supposed to be getting dis, dis, disappointed at that because that's, that's the way that the Lord made them to be, you know? And we know that we have the upper hand because guess what? Y'all, the Lord, that the one that made everything is with us. Okay, and he sent his son, and his son said that he's with us even on to the end of this earth. Okay, so the name of the Lord, Yahweh, okay, is 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 a powerful name and it's and it's excellent. Okay, so with that, I want to say uh, Salawam.